You know, no, pretty good. Still got more work to do. Yeah, just uh, just going through, you know, second year, just things I could work on last year. Just made sure I, I worked on it on the off season, just carried it over to this year so far. So everything been going smooth. Yeah. Uh, you know, a few people. Um, tr a train that I dare you around here local in uh, SFSP with uh, Oliver Davis got some good work in. Yeah, just really, just more so, just using my hands more, staying more patient at the line. You aren't getting targeted very much. Uh, what's the key to kind of staying locked in when maybe the ball, you don't see the ball for a long time? Just, you know, just anticipating the play coming my way every time. Just, you know, just not uh, being laid back too much and just staying on my P's of Q. Is that, do you look at that as a sign of uh, respect in some way that quarterbacks are uh, going your, your way at all? I mean, you know, I don't really look at it like that. I just just go out there and just do my job, and then it all speak for itself. What's this season been like for you, just health-wise? Health-wise? Yeah, I mean, you missed, you know, a week because with the concussion last week. Yeah. You know, you had the neck. What's, what's that been like? How have you dealt with that? No, nah, my week, I mean, I've been going smooth. Uh, you know, last last week was, wasn't was really nothing. Um, just just did all the precautions, whatever it was, and uh, just did everything the right way. AJ, you made a play on Sunday, man. I thought it was really interesting. You know, it was a little quick swing play about to the play. Came down, sh shot inside the, uh, shot outside the uh, wide receiver and made the tackle. Do you, like, where does that come from? Because it seemed like you kind of pride yourself on, you know, tackling and wrapping up and being physical out there. Even when it's not, when it's run play. Yeah, just, uh, just film studying, anticipating plays and trusting myself to go out there and make the plays, you know what I mean? And uh, that's just really what it go, you know, boil down to just, just uh, being instinctive and recognizing plays and understanding what's coming my way. Did your coaches at Westlake kind of emphasize that, or that was something that you kind of just always carried with yourself? Yeah, wh whether it been at my high school, my dad, just anybody, I always just take advice and uh, just run with it. Uh, yeah, you know, like I mentioned, like in camp, uh, he just gives us a variety of things to do on defense. Uh, very multiple, like the, uh, you know, we can do everybody's type job. I can play the, the curl flat, the third, and all that type of stuff. So we just do a lot of things in the defense, play man, and it was just very diverse, you know what I mean? So like you're just getting to the point where you just kind of feel comfortable in what right. defense that you're doing. Right, right, just being comfortable and just, you know, going out there doing my job. Uh, you know, just I don't even know if we hit mid mid season yet, but so far everything going smooth. Yeah. Were there, th were there things that you saw in yourself before the season? Because I remember we talked about some of your training and you know, yeah. serious things like that that you were pinpointing that had actually come to fruition. Yeah, really. Like I, I when I had answered his question, it was just really like press. You know, just being patient at the line and just using my hands more. Really, when I went into the off season, focusing on. And, I, and taking care of my body. AJ, when you came out, uh, there was a lot of conversations about, you know, rankings, or from CJ Henderson, Jeff Okuda, you know, those guys were kind of like at the top, and most like I was getting a lot of the press as far as being the best one coming out of the draft. Did you pay attention to that type of stuff, or, or you feel, did you feel slighted at, the, at that moment when those rankings came out, or did you even pay attention to it? Nah, I mean, uh, I ain't really pay attention to the rankings like that. <clears throat> I feel like, for, you know, rankings, are, you know, it's opinionated. You know, everybody got an opinion, so you, I couldn't control the draft. You know what I mean? You can't control that type of stuff. So whatever happened, just happened, and then just went, you know, go along with it. But do you kind of feel like the Falcon Tech, you, you know, where, where you are, you feel like justified, like where you, where you ended up? Yeah, I'm, I'm home. <laughs> I'm good. Were you, were you happy to see the Braves win? Oh, yeah. I don't, you know, I don't really watch baseball like that. I ain't even going to lie. 
I don't watch baseball like that, but I was locked in. <laughs> I was locked in when I seen them going to the, you know, through the semifinals and to the finals, how they just, you know, did their job and just took care of business. So I watched, I watched it. Does that, does that inspire you to, to do something like that here? Definitely. You know, they, you know, the, uh, the Hawks had a good season last year. Um, the Braves just won it all and just, you know what I mean, get our, get our ball rolling. Yeah, you know, yeah, of course I want the respect, but the rankings, like I said, I don't really pay attention to that, but I do control what I can, just go out there and, and, and earn my respect, and, you know, soon to be, it'll just, it'll all take care of itself.